Yo, what up, One Coalition? Yo, I hope everybody having a blessed night. I'm actually noticing something right now. I noticed that YouTube has me shadow banned. And the reason why I said it and I'm actually knowing that right now is because when I post a short video, my video gets like 2,000, almost 3,000 views on a short. When I post a regular video with the same caption, it stops. Like I might get like 20, 20 views in like fucking three days. Like, so it's really weird. And I understand what they're doing right here. So those of you who hear this right here, I ask you to sit back right now. Um, ask yourself, have you been through my content? Have you looked at my content? Have you actually felt my content? Have you actually understood where I'm coming from as a African man who's trying to bring our African people together and, and stop this separation that these people are trying to cause? And um, and some people might sit back and say like, yo, how you, how you um, focus on one person that's doing this right here? It's because that's the only person who is trying to separate us as far as like making us not remember our history as being Africans and try to make us like we came from here, like we Aboriginal people. When deep down, the history books have shown that the Native Americans were the only Aboriginal people who were here. Excuse me, because I've been drinking tequila 1800. I'm a grown man, y'all grown people, y'all understand this shit right here. So it seems like um, they're trying to break apart who we are. Like, you know what I'm saying? It seems like this is how it goes from the beginning of time because even when the slave when the slave ships left Africa, right? Some people landed in the island of Jamaica. Some people landed in the island of the Dominican Republic. Some people landed in Haiti. Like like the Virgin Islands. All these places. Even even as far as like 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 uh Seychelles and stuff like that, like they had black people go there and they enslaved us. So now you got black people thinking that like they done something for themselves and they gotta lose their roots and stuff like that. And that's what black Americans are doing right now. Because from the beginning of time, once they erased our history during slavery, it seems like black people who were over here forgot they were from Africa. And the real true people know. That's why you have Pan-Africanists like Marcus Garvey. You have uh, people like um, shit, Malcolm X. You got people like Haile Selassie. I. You got all the uh, the real true African. You got PLO. You know what I'm saying? You got man, so many people I can name right now, but I don't even want to go through the list. But y'all understand that y'all African people. You know what I'm saying? Like African people were taken to different places, but we seem to have lost our history. So over here to bring it back to the head right here, you have the foundational black Americans, which is my arch nemesis because y'all niggas acting like y'all blind and following a nigga who hasn't done anything for y'all personally. Only thing he's done for you from for y'all is to build something to say like it's y'all. Like the same way like black people join gangs and black people join um societies because they want to feel accepted. They want to feel like something belongs to them. And that nigga listen to the the IA and the BI, that's what I'm gonna call them right there, and um, linked into that. And I think my channel's being shadow banned because of that right there. And I don't have the support that he has, but I do have my true loyal followers who understand. Because I look at myself as a conscious brother um, who knows both sides of the game. Um, here I am, I'm born in America, raised in America, but my parents are Americo Liberians. And my roots go back from being free slaves who went back to Africa, but then came back. So my parents are American Liberians. And if y'all don't know what it is, look up American Liberians. So you speaking to someone right, well, I'm speaking to y'all as someone right now who never had somewhere to claim. Because on either side of myself, I can't claim full Africa because Africa black. Oh no, you American. I can't claim full America because America is black. Oh, you African. So it's like everybody who is considered American Liberian is a part of the fight. They are really like inter intertwined with the fight because we can't claim America and we can't claim Africa. Africans say we not too much African and Americans say we ain't too much American so we from Africa. And if you do the roots on the American Liberians, y'all understand that they were freed slaves who went back during the ACS movement, went back over there, colonized the people over there, so they got animosity, and then came back over here and still became over here and became successful. So you gotta understand where my roots come from. I'm trapped in a in a fucking matrix, you know what I'm saying? And that been that way all my life. My family, we ain't never had no hood to claim none of that shit because we were always taught when we was raised that we ain't from here, you know what I'm saying? And then we go to Africa, it's like, yeah, we from here, but then the African people are like, man, nigga, y'all not really African, y'all American Liberians, y'all ain't from here. So look up the history, I can say it right there.
but um, this is the main basis of my channel, and I hope that I have logical people, and people who understand the fight that I'm trying to go against, and, and the knowledge I'm trying to give my people who understand me. I know I got a whole tribe of people. Y'all know y'all Congo people, Congo people got a whole tribe of people, and America would look at the name and say Congo, but it's called Conga, and Conga means America Liberian. America Liberian are people who were free slaves and went back. So when you speak about reparations, um, America Liberians are a part of reparation right there because we were free slaves who went back to Africa. And I wish that everybody would have did what my ancestors did and went back to Africa, but they didn't. But um, I just want to let y'all know, man, like that's the truth right there and that's real fact. And I'm gonna keep continuing to make these videos and um, make this content to let y'all know what's up. Yo, One Coalition, have a blessed day.